Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Ari Views back with another video and today we're talking about AirPods and AirPods Pro. Apple has just released new firmware updates. Actually, we have two different updates that have just been released. One for the AirPods Pro, that's the version 4A402 and another one for the AirPods which will actually support only the new AirPods 3 and that's the version 4B66. So the older, the original AirPods and the AirPods 2 don't get an update this time. So in this video I will show you guys what's new with these firmware updates and of course how to get a better chance to getting this firmware as soon as possible on your device because as we know right now there is no like direct way to update the firmware of your AirPods. So let's get into the video right now but before we get into that another thing you should actually do right now is hit the like button on this video that is really really helpful of course will help this video a lot and help this channel do a lot better so make sure you smash the like button. So as I said we have two different updates one will be for the AirPods Pro and another one for the AirPods 3. Now currently we are on version for a 400 for the AirPods Pro. So if you have the AirPods Pro, you can connect them to your iPhone, go to the Bluetooth section, tap that little I button right there, and you will see right here the current version you're on. Now, of course, there is no direct way to force your AirPods to update, but there is, of course, like a trick that you can use to maybe force them to update sooner, but that is, of course, not guaranteed, but you will get eventually the update on your device, on your AirPods Pro, probably in a matter of days, maybe even hours, you will get that update automatically. But of course, there are a few simple steps that you can follow in order to make sure that that will happen sooner. Now, in order to do that, what you need to do is make sure that you connect your AirPods to your iPhone, have them connected right here and plug them in to charge and have, of course, them in range of your iPhone. And once you do that, you can close the lid and just leave them like that and wait for the update to happen. That should take maybe a few minutes, maybe a few hours. Nobody actually knows how to exactly force the update on the AirPods and the AirPods Pro, but that will happen automatically in the background. So you don't actually need to worry about that. Just keep using your AirPods and you will get the update eventually in a matter of hours or maybe even a few days. And now let's talk about what has changed with the new 4A402 update for the AirPods Pro and the 4B66 update for the AirPods 3. Well, actually there is no like release notes from Apple, but what this should do is actually fix problems that a lot of people have been experiencing since the last update with the new feature notify when left behind. So a lot of people have reported that this feature has actually not been working properly for them. They have not been notified. And we also had like reports from people that they actually got the notification even though they had their AirPods closed by. So false notifications and not getting notifications at all. These are two problems that have appeared with the last update of the AirPods Pro and that what this should fix. You can see it's like a, a small update and don't expect to see any like big features or any visual changes to any feature or stuff like that. So this is the main problem that Apple have right now with AirPods. Notify when left behind and some people even don't get to use this feature at all. I've seen reports that this is actually not available for a lot of people. So this is what the new AirPods firmware should fix. Even though again, we don't have an exact release note from Apple letting us know what this update does, but this should be new. And of course I have my AirPods here. I didn't have any problem with this feature. It works as it should. But again, we had a lot of reports from people all around the internet talking about this feature not working properly and that's what this update should fix. So that's pretty much it for this video guys. These are the new updates for the AirPods Pro and the AirPods 3 and expect those problems to be fixed with these new updates. And of course, a few simple tips and tricks on how to actually force your iPhone to update even though that's not guaranteed, but the update will eventually happen. Just make sure you keep your iPhone and your AirPods connected and you will get the update in a matter of hours or maybe even a few days. So that's pretty much it. Go ahead and subscribe for more videos if you haven't already. And of course, don't forget to leave a like on the video.